Hi, MC Bling Daddy here with a way to open your world to the net in Windows without using a server, yet easily specify a single standard port for guest logins, as well as allowing them to use cheats. The problem is, if you start a world in a single user mode, you can use the publish command to open the world to the LAN, and you can specify the port you want, in this case 25566, but guests are limited in their use of commands, and they can't put down or set up command blocks. On the other hand, if you escape to pause the world, you can open the world to the LAN and allow guests to use cheats, but you can't specify the port. It is randomly generated by Minecraft, in this case 51286. You'll need to note what this port number is in your own case. Now, further opening the world to the Internet usually requires setup on a router involving port forwarding. Minecraft doesn't seem to have a way to specify both the LAN port and keep permissions for cheats on. Well, if you use the open to LAN route so you still allow cheats, you don't need to reset login specs for users on the LAN or change ports for your router or port forwarding. Instead, open a Windows Command Prompt window as administrator. Assuming your PC is connected to the LAN with the IP number 192.168.1.127, and you always want other users to be able to log in to port 25566, enter the following network shell command. net sh interface port proxy add v4 to v4, listen port equals 25566, listen address equals 192.168.1.127, connect port equals 51286, connect address equals 192.168.1.127. Listen port and address are the port and PC IP number you want users to log into. Connect port and address are the port and PC IP number you are using to run your world. It works for multiplayer servers as well as open to LAN in single user mode. However, a word of warning, setup is still not complete unless you've opened your Windows firewall to the incoming port, the listen port 25566. You may have done that if you run a server. If you know how to do it, let port 25566, or whatever you use, through the firewall, then you'll be good to go. If not, I'll have a video up next week explaining how to do it, so look for that. But if you can open or have previously opened the firewall to the port, then you can consistently use it only. You won't need to tell guests to log in on any special port if you've already told them to 5566. They should be able to log in as they always have. And now they have cheats enabled. Also, to demonstrate that the Minecraft assigned port is still being used too, we can log in using that specially assigned port instead. By the way, if you want to verify in the command prompt what ports are being used, try the commands netstat-ano pipe find str 25566 and netstat-ano pipe find str 51286. Well, happy command execution and thanks for watching.